for the women's mile run. 16 competitors on the track, including the double Olympic champion from Atlanta, Svetlana Masterkova of Russia. She won both the 800 meters and the 1500 meters in Atlanta. So fit was she, Larry, that she sprinted her victory lap after the 800. I was amazed. She was one of the biggest surprises I found, uh, Dwight. And uh, the woman from Russia, who we'll go into more detail of as the race settles down, is uh, coming back after two years of being away from the sport uh, with the birth of a daughter as well. And uh, she was the 800 and 1500 meter winner in Atlanta, and a big surprise. In this race, there will be a rabbit in the race. Um, and the pace is expected to be very quick that they're trying to accomplish here. The mile will go by at 63, 206, and 310 of all things is what they're hoping to accomplish. Ludmila uh, Borisova uh, of the Soviet Union will be out there pressing the pace. And we'll check those times as they go by. That is Borisova. And right on her shoulder is Mastrakova. And about 62 seconds for the first 400 meters. So Mastrakova going for a decent time. She's done everything else this year by winning two gold medals in Atlanta. So an assault on the world record may be in her plans. Also in the race, back in fifth place, a little bit no man's land that you see out there. And that is Regina Jacobs of the U.S., who had a wonderful Olympics in many ways. She ran 407, 406, and 407 in five days. That is she, number 336. And she's trying to hold on here at a very fast pace for these ladies. Of course, this race probably missing uh, the best athlete in the world last year, female athlete of the year, Sonia O'Sullivan. But in the person of Mastrakova, who's still sitting there second, following the pace very closely, she is the woman of the year so far, certainly in the middle distance races. O'Sullivan of Ireland having some viral problems in Atlanta and unable to do well in the 5,000 or the 1,500. There you see. Yeah. 2066, wow. roughly. So right on pace, as you mentioned at the beginning of the race. Now, the tough pace will be, I think, coming up right now. Can she hold a 310? If she holds a 310, we are in position then to see, I think, a world record for the women's mile. 4.15.61 seconds is the world record, and it has certainly stood for a while. And let's see, I think Mastakova is in better shape than most people expect. She ran 156 last week. She is very fit. We could have a tremendous effort here by her. Well, she was chomping at the bit to go by Borisova before the kilometer mark, which was obviously the designated distance that she was to take Mastakova through. And now Mastakova has to fight hard in this third lap Regina Jacobs is the American who is the leader of the pack behind Mastrakova, but she is at least 35 meters ahead of that pack. And this is normally here in Zurich when they set up a race for someone, no one else is allowed to get in the way. Let's see how she's doing. 3.12.6, so she did lose a little bit there. She's gonna have to really get on her horse. She needs to run 63 seconds for the last lap. Right, I'm watching her leg turnover. She's got a shot if she doesn't die in the home stretch. She's picking it up. Her 50, I'm sorry, her 800 meter and 400 meter speed is best that she's ever had. I think she's very fit. She can run 155. She looks good to me in the back stretch. She's within striking distance of Paula Ivan's world record, 415.61, set in 1989. 200 meters to go. Let's see, she's got now, what, 60 yards on the rest of the field. And how many times? Mastakova. How many times have we said that you've got to run that third lap to set yourself up for the good kick? Mastakova's turnover, as you said, very, very good here. The head is starting to bob and weave a little bit. She's lifting into this capacity crowd. They will carry her through. Now it's just a matter of watching the clock. Standing row only. They're here all clapping. She's got a shot. She's got it, Dwight. She's got it. 60-second last lap, and she obliterates Paula Ivan's world record in a mile. Regina Jacobs of the United States finishing well back, but in second place. Svetlana Mastrakova continues to surprise and show that she is the class of women's middle distance running in 1996. Never in history. 4.12 for the mile. Breaks the record by more than three seconds. The last 200 meters run at sub-60 second pace. 
this woman has more left in her. I mean, just amazing. I mentioned she had taken some time off, and she said, I am guilty of being lazy. I didn't have to take two years off, but I did. She said, I have trained exceedingly hard over the last year, and she's been healthy since last May when she kept upping her training and upping her program, uh, and she's just been doing amazing. Right off the bat, we're just setting all kinds of records here at the Velfossa. Svetlana Marstrokova of Russia with a world record in the mile, and we'll be back with more from the Veltklasse meet in Zurich. <laughs>